Um, it used to be thought that you should only use Kimberly, but uh, it turns out that nope. I figured that out, but I'll explain it later. Alright, there we go. Hit, hit, hit. One, two, three, four. These guys are gonna spawn. I'm gonna air the crap out of them. Don't think I did not notice you, jerk. Alright, let's go. <laughs> it's. This is a, a good hits. run. Thank you. Damn you! Okay. Um, so basically, that arrow is supposed to insta kill like one hit putties, but there is something seriously wrong with my game or just the programming of this game, and sometimes it just does not work. <laughs> so those two are supposed to be dead, but nope. <laughs> so that's what's wrong with the bow? The yeah, that's what's wrong with the bow. I have no idea why this is the case, but what happened? Oh, I forgot about you. There we go. <laughs> Could there be anything wrong with Kimberly? Do you have ammo for your arrows? No, nope, unlimited. But they just randomly don't work, and it has cost me so many runs. <laughs> Alright, one, two, three, four. So this boss, like, damage values don't make any sense against this guy. Normally, it's uh, the first two hits do one damage, the third hit does two, and the last hit does four. This guy's rules, I have no idea. <laughs> Okay, so I have done a lot of different combos against this guy in order to avoid this because he's just going to reattach himself. But it turns out that just um, doing the forehead combo twice and making him reattach is actually the fastest way. Damn, there we go. So I, I missed a quick kill there, but whatever. He's done. <laughs> so it used to be thought that you used Kimberly through the whole run, but. Trini, you're up. So Trini has a mid-range throw, like her throw goes like a little shorter than Kimberly's, but it's actually really useful for this stage. But the most useful thing about her is that she can, her uh, attack in ranger form is actually slightly faster than everyone else's. And she's the only one that can actually get a full forehead combo on the boss of the stage. At least consistently. The others can, but it's very rare. So. <laughs> so uh, a big thing, I have to get them to like land at the other dude's feet instead of hitting each other. Boom. That uh, that barrel there did AoE damage. Oh, you son of a! Come back here. Thank you. Okay. It's it's the big thing is get them at each other's feet and make sure they don't hit each other. Otherwise, they'll miss a line. These two, I have no good setup for. I'm not gonna hit them both. See, otherwise they just jump around like jerk offs. And waste a lot of time. Was that your first time getting hit in the run, I think? Yeah. I'm just taking intentional damage here because the barrel actually spawns that other dude. There we go, line them up. Oh, you! Tricky! So this is what happens if you misalign them, they just jump around and it's silly. It's <coughs> Kicks. Okay, line up, line up, there we go. So, hit you, hit you, throw you. What? Okay. So, that was supposed to be a throw so that he would land the other dude's feet. He didn't, that didn't happen, unfortunately. Whatever. Seems like she forward. has a much shorter range than her attacks. Yeah, the range is different depending on the ranger. Her punch does not go very far, unfortunately. So, why do they wait so long before putting up the uniforms? Because he's Power Rangers. Okay. It's actually pretty accurate to the show, so. Four. Let's them come back. One, or, okay, one, two, three, four. Okay, gonna hit you. There we go. One, two, three, four. Alright. Be in there. So now we're gonna go up this ascent here. Oh, you. Okay. So what's the divide between beating up and the other platforming stage? Uh, this is like the only real platforming stage. <laughs> that breaks up a little bit. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Also, welcome to the best jump recovery animation. Four. In any video ever. Four. Why are there Four. flaming metal beams falling from the ceiling? Don't ask me any questions, buddy. 
Okay, so this is a glitch that uh, was found. Basically, I do the bomb. That part of the stage is not supposed to load up yet. So, now I'm gonna go ahead and do this. Gonna do this. One, two, three. One, two, three, four. Gonna hit you up here. Now the game is really confused. Um, <laughs> yeah. And now that part of the stage just gets skipped over. So, there you go. Please tell me we're doing bonus stream highlights. Yeah. Now I'm gonna go up here. I need a bomb, actually, because uh, the next boss is a thing. So. You can only hold one bomb at a time? Only one bomb at a time, yeah. You don't, there would be no reason to have more than one bomb, honestly. Uh, we just figured out a very similar bomb to the last one. Well. How dare you? <laughs> How dare you question the artistic integrity of the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers? Video? This game is legitimately good, by the way. <laughs> I can tell, yeah. Three, four. Over here, on TV, four. So wait, you're telling me a TV show that reused footage from Japan reuses backgrounds in this video game? Yeah. And reuses Ranger Sprites. You'll notice that uh, Trini here is just as buff of a man as Kimberly. So there you go. <laughs> it reuses quality. Although that's actually accurate to the show, given that the Yellow Ranger in Japan is actually a guy. He's actually a guy, yep. Up here. Kick. Kick. Whatever, <laughs> now you're lined up. Yeah, both of you. I know you're coming. Hey, how are you doing? Bye. Alright, so I'm gonna destroy this thing here. Purple E boy is gonna show up. <laughs> I'm gonna mess up his friend as well. Now I'm gonna throw you just mixed up a little bit, so now I can both of you. And now I'm gonna throw you so that I can both of you. Oh, hey. They'll be cute. Okay. Someone in chat is like, why is the yellow ranger you size? Raphael is the red turtle normally. <laughs> Alright, so daggers. this boss is a little interesting. He can give me good luck or bad luck. We'll see what happens. Not a good start. Not a good start. You jerk! <laughs> <laughs> one, two, three, one, two, three, four. Yeah, there we go, full combos. One, two, three. Oh, I messed up. Oh, well. One, two, three, one, two, three, four. Guess one more time. Oh, really? Okay. <laughs> Unexpected, but okay. Got him! Yes! <laughs> so, yeah, you're not to, So, Trini there is able to do four hit combos. All, all the other rangers, like, either just can't do it, or it's very random if they get it. You have to be very, very lucky. She does it consistently. So, yes, Kimberly. I used to use Jason on this state. Oh, and uh, also, I did a thing where I, uh, you know, did extended combos. You're not supposed to be able to do, like, two loops of combos on him. But, uh, tricks. What are you gonna do? <laughs> Alright, so I used to use Jason on the stage, because he was faster and more consistent for me, but uh, the other runner of this game, uh, his name is Dancho one Shouts to Dancho one twitch.tv slash Dancho one um, He figured out ways to make sure that Kimberly was faster here, so I use Kimberly here now. Question from the chat, best Megazord? Uh, <laughs> the original, because the original's best. And you'll actually be seeing him later in this run. Awesome. Do you ever use Billy? Oh, Billy! Oh, uh, Billy, 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 Billy. Uh, when I was a kid, I thought Billy was the greatest because, like, he hits the enemy a bunch of times. But he's actually got the slowest walk speed, the slowest jump that doesn't go that very, that does not go far at all, the slowest throw. And in Ranger form, he's the worst because his attack like hits multiple times in order to do full damage and doesn't work on all the bosses. So he is by far the slowest Ranger in this game. There should be a Billy category. There is. There is a Billy category. It's called Billy Percent. And for the record, my BB on Billy Percent is faster than the current SDA record, so just throwing that out there. Okay. Wait, this is on SDA? I remember that. Oh, you will see that dance. Alright, there we go. Huh? Oh, um, if you get a healing item, it stacks, actually. Oh, so you've actually got more than... Wow. Yeah, so I have more than what was supposed to be max health now. Then that would make it to max, wouldn't it? Oh, damn. Dang. Uh, because of that drill hit me, I couldn't try for a silly glitch. Basically, for this load zone, it usually you lose control early, but this one, they give you more time. Like, you can control the character for longer than you're supposed to. And so if you jump at just the right distance, the game gets really confused and the boss like glitches the hell out. Um, the problem with that glitch though is, for whatever reason, my card is <laughs> acting up and so it hasn't been working at all this weekend. And uh, the other thing is if I like overshoot it or whatever, the game soft locks, so. 
For a submittable run, I think it's necessary, though. So, White Ranger or Green Ranger? Huh? White Ranger or Green Ranger? Neither, because neither of them are in this game. Okay. <laughs> you know there's a TV show that they might be talking about. Yeah, everyone loved Tommy for whatever reason. Well, everyone, see, well, everyone said they loved Tommy, and secretly they just like the Pink Ranger. Let's be honest. <laughs> there's a bit of a war going on in chat between Megazord and Voltron. And who would win? Megazord, <laughs> easy. Please. Hold up now. And we do have someone saying Optimus me, Prime for best Megazord. <laughs> Ooh, okay. Yo, best Megazord donation. Well, let's go. Do it. Okay, so we're gonna wait here. Hey, you're gonna dance a little bit. Okay. <laughs> Apparently, the Power Rangers' greatest weakness is water. Yeah. Right? Oh, geez, they can't oh you oh. son of a monk! Oh, jeez. <laughs> Um, uh, buffer, 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 yes! So yeah, the buffer in range of form is ridiculous. As you can see, I waited all that time and my fourth hit still was loaded up, so... <laughs> so yeah, uh, I guess I can detail a little bit about this run. Um, when I first, like, came to SEA, like, this game is... Nice, I got the damage boost, that's really hard to do. But uh, when I first came to SDA, like I noticed there was a Mighty Morphin Power Ranger run. I'm like, oh well, I can't, I can't run this game because someone like rounded the hell out of this game. Um, then like one day, I saw like a stream of this guy named Deln, D E L N. He was streaming like just like uh, his runs of this game, and I'm like, and I like had a serious nostalgia bomb. I'm like, oh man, I loved this game when I was a kid. And so I was watching him like I could improve this run. And at the same time, there's another dude that was already beating his run named Dan Show, and I didn't know about him at the time. But I was like, so I watched him and was like, okay, this is pretty good, but I can definitely improve this. So I started running and I like, you know, started using some of the task strats like uh, canceling moves and stuff because they weren't doing that at the time. And so it just like cut off time substantially. Like I beat the SDA run like my second night of just messing around. And then, oh, thank you. So do you and like, uh, I started like, I will once I get like 28, 40 something. But, uh, like, at the t I started, like, introducing a bunch of new things. Like, I found a bunch of little tricks and time savers and everything. And I figured the Dan show would just, like, kind of drop out because I was optimizing it way further than anyone would realistically be optimizing Mighty Morphin Power Rangers. <laughs> but it turns out he's just as crazy as I am and started picking up the strats. And so we went back and forth in world records for a couple months. He actually has the current record at about um, 2754, but we are convinced that it can go as low as 2730-something. So, yeah, after this marathon, I'm gonna go back to the grind on this game. What's the, what's the task time? Task time is something ridiculously low. <laughs> it does, like, some, like, weird trick with the bow that's, like, completely impossible. <laughs> like, the task, like, beats this guy by, like, hitting it, like, a bajillion times with the bow, and we have no idea how that works. <laughs> but it is a really good task. Check it out. So, yeah, this guy is, like, completely luck dependent, because if he has a bad pattern, I can't hit him as much. He actually gave me a really good pattern there. If he walks or like shoots a bunch of little eyes, it's awesome. Okay. Q. Yeah, you're gonna pop up the bomb. I need to hit him a few more times after this bomb. And he's down. So stage three next. Stage four next, right? All right, so uh, the Trini thing was actually discovered sort of discovered by someone on the uh, SDA topic like years and years ago. He said, oh, I noticed that Trini, um... Yeah, there we go. The totally unironic Black Ranger. Let's go. Yeah, 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 yeah. Totally. Yes. Pants. Pants. No stereotypes pants. with this character design. Oh, no. Oh, 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 <laughs> I mean, that medallion is purely for fashion. Yeah. Go. I'm not so yeah, this is probably like my biggest contribution, like one of the biggest discoveries I made is that Zack is the fastest on this level for a normal playthrough. <laughs> oh, hey. Come on. Yeah, I got them both. That's why. His leg hits really, really far. Kimberly cannot do what Zack can do with his leg. With her leg. <laughs> Bad throw. There was invincibility on the throw, that's why I did it. Because usually I wouldn't throw with him because it's pretty slow. I'm gonna try to line you up. There we go. There we go. 
up, line up, line up, line up. Yes! Thank you. Damn. Alright. So yeah, I use everyone but Jason, but Billy. I used to use Jason, but Kimberly's just faster on the level at the end of the day. Also, like, uh, Dan Show says that he found, like, a major skip on stage 3, but he's only ever gotten, like, twice in his entire life and doesn't know the rules of it, so... Tassers, if you want to experiment a little bit, uh, feel free. Yes, it relates to that, uh, floating enemy glitch that I showed off. Damn. Okay. Yo, line up, line up. Oh, whatever. So yeah, um, Zack and Billy have really awesome low kicks that take down multiple hit enemies in like four hits where everyone else is slower and takes five. And uh, Billy is just too too slow, so Zack is the way to go with this level. Oh, Billy play. There you go, moving forward. So yeah, this is an awesome stage. You know, a lot of technicalities on this. Check it out, I can backflip. And the mandatory elevator. Yeah, yeah. Have to beat him up in an elevator. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I think I see why you wish there was a difficulty select, and not in the way I was thinking. <laughs> oh, hey. Oh, sir. <laughs> nice, take thank a you. Selfie. What? Whoa, whoa. <laughs> take a selfie. Uh, <laughs> He has time. <laughs> Selfie for sure. Alrighty. Yep. Oh well. Okay, so line up. Alright. Shout out to Catherine, who I just texted. Alright. BRB playing card. Thank you very much. I'm coming for you, Muted. Also, shout out to the Twin Towers in the background, even though this is clearly supposed to take place in California. They borrowed them. Yeah. Also, you can just throw these guys in fits. Whatever. Alright. What's the test time? Yeah. We had, Dan Show and I actually found some new stuff that would blow the tass out of the water, so they should probably pick up on that. There's some very reckless construction workers above you. <laughs> <laughs> Don't need this anymore. <laughs> yep. well, Insta-kill. Insta-kill. Okay. Insta-kill. Okay. Okay, enemies, moving on. Those enemies generally take more hits when they get on screen. Uh, yeah, if they get on screen, then you actually have to combo them to death. But uh, you just instantly killed him right there for some stupid reason. <coughs> that, I believe, was discovered by Dan Show, so shout out to him for that. So, yeah, this boss. It's a boss. <laughs> Don't do me three dragons, thank you. Okay, now I'm gonna combo him. Now I'm gonna combo him. Are you gonna do something? No, I'm just gonna combo you again. <laughs> hey, are you? Nope, nope, okay. Maybe if he uh, uncrossed hey. his arms. Okay. <laughs> okay. Uh huh. Uh huh. Okay, he's gonna do something. Nope. Uh, totally nice hard. try, jerk. Okay. He was waiting for me to make a wish. <laughs> so, uh, with that boss, uh, if you hit him before he fully teleports, then he teleports again and, like, quickly hits you. But if you just wait like a second, then he just eats your combo. You can actually infinite that guy by doing like three hits, wait a second, three hits over and over again. But it's slower than just doing that, so. At Return of Kimberly. Here we go. This stage. It's a stage. It's kind of annoying, actually. Alright. So yeah, Kimberly's throw time, uh, throws, oh, right. Okay, so Kimberly's throw, like, range, distance on her throws is actually really useful here. Man of beat, damn. Okay, it's okay. Alright, moving forward. It's. It's. Man of feet, thank you. Alright, these are the problems. Man of feet, good. Yes. Input is actually real. Like, input ability is actually a massive thing in this game because you cannot draw that combo or you lose a ton of time. Final hit. 
the comic does a lot more of this? Uh, it does, but it's like you're frozen in place for a time afterwards. So it's faster to do three hit, three hit. Okay. Oh, okay. Also, you'll notice that I waste, wait a second after throwing the enemy if I know it's going to hit, because then the other one will like move forward slightly. So they're more lined up again. There we go. Three, one. Damn it! I had to make sure that. Oh no. Oh no. Okay. Whew! Okay. Alright. They have to die at the same time, otherwise the spawns get like messed up. Sword dudes. Okay. Alright. I like how he just stands there and waits for you to do this. Yeah. So, like, yeah, throw you. The big throw is slower than the short range throw, but you know it lines them up better certain times. So. If we raise another thirty nine thousand dollars, we're beating everything that Desmond has ever made. One, two, three, four. Yes. Yeah. Hit that so that this enemy spawns. Yeah. Can you play that out? So I just despawned a barrel by like running forward. Whatever. <laughs> oh yeah, I have to kill that barrel in order to spawn both of these. There we go. Alright. Alright. See you. There we go. Oosh. Oh, hey, okay. A little too, a little, not quite far enough for the tree stuff. Okay. Gotta hit you. One, two, three, four. Hit you. Into you. Oh, you got this one. Oh, well. Let's see if I can get it. Yeah, gun skin. Yeah, other gun skin. Alright. Yep. Yep. One, two, three, four. Alrighty. One, two, three, four. All right. All right, we're in there. We're in there. This is like the worst screen in the game. There's like no distraction for it. You just kind of hope that they kind of go nice. Um. Okay. Whatever. That was pretty bad, but. Yeah. Okay. There we go. One, two. Now I have to wait a bit so the other one spawns. There we go. Okay. Moving forward. Moving forward. I'm gonna arrow you just to mix it up a little bit. Okay. Four. Arrow you. Use. <laughs> this is why I hate the arrow so much. <laughs> because to get a world record, you have to use the arrow, but it sometimes decides it doesn't it doesn't want to work anymore. Any of the other runners have a problem? Nope. Dan shows cart loves him. Yeah. Damage boost. Yep, damage boost. So this is something that I uh, I used to do a full four combo on this, but since coming in the marathon, I decided to switch it up a little bit. So, bomb. Two, three. So, I'm like, pretty sure that saves a little bit of time. One, two. Alright, whatever. Yeah, whatever. Alright, gonna hit you. One, two. Wait a little bit, wait a little bit. There we are. Alright. Lost time. So yeah, the trick with this boss is he can teleport around, which we don't want to do. However, if you never scroll the screen, he doesn't teleport. Ah. So... Yeah, kind of. It's, it's pretty RNG. There we go. He does that a lot. I don't want him to throw bombs. I just want to make sure... But I want him to stick around. You see, that's good. Yeah, that wastes time. Ah. But I have to make sure I'm hitting him to the right. Otherwise that happens. <coughs> Trap him in the left corner? 
Nah, he'll just teleport away. Oh, that, okay, that's why he teleported there. Yeah. Wait for it. There we go. There we go. There we are. That's decent luck. He didn't bomb too much, so. Alright, so here, these next two bosses are the run killers. They're completely random. Megazord, let's go. But, um, basically, um, if these guys decide to just block everything, there's nothing I can do about it. <laughs> and I've lost the vast majority of my runs to them, because, just because. These guys can, like, do anything from, like, saving minutes to losing minutes, so. Just complete random BS. Megazord hype. Megazord hype. Oh, okay. Okay, not bad. Whatever. That was a pretty bad fight. Also, if you kill him in the corner, he walks forward slightly and just wastes time like a jerk. Alright, and that's actually like the lesser of the two problems. This next guy, Cyclopsis, he's the real problem. Fun fact, swords explode people. Yeah. <laughs> also, we're taking this thing to the moon! Yeah! <laughs> So yeah, this guy. Bang. This guy. Zoom. Uh, uh. So what I just tried there was, yeah, that's the fastest way to, to do damage. <laughs> Damn you. Okay. Come on. Position yourself a little bit here. Come on. Come on. Yes. Oh, or not. Usually the second hit will hit if you hit the first one, but he's, he's just being like boxes, so. What's the meter at the bottom? Uh, it's a power bar. You can push a button and do a special depending on how high it is. Alright, and, oh, well, like no, that? No. Yeah. Um, I, I'm going to uh, hit time at the uh, last hit, so I'll let you know when. Okay, come on. Good. You can actually cross them up and it's unblockable, but you have to... Good. Okay. Damn you. Okay. Come on, just one hit. You son of a... Okay, come on, there we go, time. Oh, not bad. Not bad. <laughs> Alright, and uh, this ending is a... Uh, it's an ending. <laughs> so, uh, remember the totally unironic Black Ranger? Well, uh... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I feel so ashamed. Yeah. Billy. Really? Yeah, Billy's just, so just right. a couple of high schoolers driving around in a pink car. I don't know what Kimberly's sitting on, but something. <laughs> this look at Zach. Yeah, Zach is his sprite. Oh, yeah, yeah. Billy just wants to steal them. Oh, Billy. Maybe he's trying to warn them about the danger of sitting like that. Look at Billy. <laughs> like, Billy just knows how bad he is in this game. Yeah. <laughs> he's like, hmm. <laughs> I don't want right. to look at the so uh, this next screen is, uh, I think it just kind of speaks for itself. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's for our amusement, Zach. Dance. Yeah. dance, dance. Shout out to Bulk and Skull in the background. Oh, yeah. Super shout out to Billy with the greatest dance in the history of mankind. <laughs> <laughs> he looks, he's not supposed to be fat in the show, honestly. <laughs> Yeah. So yeah, that's uh, Mighty Morphin Power Rangers. So right, I'm, gonna go, I'm gonna go to a quick commercial. And we're at commercial.